So you're the new owner of an Xterra SFL dual belt cleaner. First of all, congratulations. It was our goal to get you a primary and secondary cleaning option without the pains of mounting two units or maintaining scraper tension. This instructional video will have three parts. First of all, the installation of the Xterra SFL dual belt cleaner, and then replacement instructions of both the primary and the secondary blade. A quick note before we get started, if you do not have mounting brackets already installed on your conveyor, you do have the option to purchase these Superior brand brackets separately. If you're using your current brackets, the following bracket mounting steps are not required. Installation. To properly install your brackets, you'll need to measure out the horizontal distance, your X value, and vertical distance, which is your Y value, from the center of the head pulley shaft to the center of the mounting brackets. Both the horizontal and vertical dimensions can be found in your operator's manual. In addition, it's important to note that the distance from the edge of the belt to the center of the bracket must be your Z value, which can also be found in your operator's manual. From here, you can align your brackets to the conveyor and drill the holes accordingly. It is important to note that you have the option to either bolt or weld the mounting brackets onto your conveyor. After you drill the holes, insert the supplied bolts and attach the brackets to both sides of your conveyor. Once the brackets are installed, you can go ahead and remove the mounting plates from both sides of the belt scraper. So the cleaner is now ready to be installed onto your conveyor. You may need to remove one of the bolts from the brackets to get the belt scraper properly mounted. Next, attach the mounting plates to the brackets with the supplied bolts. Make sure that the distance from the edge of the blade to the edge of the pulley is equal on both sides of your conveyor. That is important. It ensures that your belt cleaner is centered on your pulley. Next, tighten the bolts on both sides of the belt cleaner. Now you can take a look at the secondary blade. If you are using vulcanized belt fasteners, it's important that the blade is perpendicular to the belt. This ensures proper cleaning. To do so, loosen these six bolts and adjust the blade accordingly. Don't forget to re-tighten those bolts once you have the blade perpendicular to the belt. If you are using mechanical belt fasteners, no change is needed, as the product is shipped ready for your style of splice. From here, go ahead and loosen the carriage bolts to ensure that the secondary blade makes proper contact with the belt. Primary blade replacement. Start by tightening the carriage bolts on the bottom side of the belt cleaner. This pulls the secondary blade away from the belt. Once that's done, you can remove both the pins on each side of the belt scraper. This allows you to pull off the current blade. When you have successfully taken off the old blade, you can go ahead and attach the new one to the belt cleaner frame. To complete replacement of the primary belt cleaner, simply place the pins back into their secured position and then loosen the carriage bolts back into their operating position. Secondary blade replacement. Start by tightening the carriage bolts on the bottom side of the belt cleaner. This pulls the secondary blade away from the belt. Once that's done, you can remove the top two bolts from the secondary blade. This loosens up the blade and allows you to remove it from the belt cleaning frame. When you have successfully removed the old blade, go ahead and attach the new blade with the provided bolts. Your last step, loosen the carriage bolts on the underside of the belt cleaner to allow the blades to come in correct contact with the belt. We sure hope these instructions for installing the Xterra SFL dual belt cleaner were easy to understand. But don't forget, you can always call us. We're at 800-321-1558. We've got plenty of folks inside at Superior to help you install your belt cleaners effectively for the maximum cleaning power.